captured on a doorbell camera in our high country. You can see it here, five mountain lions walking past a neighborhood at night. This neighborhood is very close to an elementary school. Our Mountain Newsroom reporter Spencer Wilson spoke with the woman who caught it all on video. Andrew says that it's not uncommon for her ring doorbell video to capture things like bear or moose, but never before has she seen five mountain lions just walking past her front door. It was about 11 o'clock the other night and I got a notification from ring and there it was five mountain lions walking through my side yard. These deadly predators just traipsing through someone's backyard on a random evening. Not uncommon in Colorado, but uncommon to see it. We, we've had an assortment of bears and, you know, other wildlife, moose, of course, around there too. So, yeah, it is a concern if you have pets or even young children. That's why Summit Lost Pet Rescue put out the call, warning folks of the dangers that await pets if they're left to roam at night. We usually see them one at a time, maybe two, but five, that was... That was pretty scary. She said this isn't about just pets, though. Wildlife, especially mountain lions, they'll prey on pets and young kids, especially if people are running from them. You know, the, the, the worst thing you can do is turn your back and run from a mountain lion. And considering the proximity to Silverthorne Elementary School, it's something they want all parents to keep an eye on as these cubs grow up to become even more dangerous. We live in the wildlife's uh, territory. They were here first. We respect that. Uh, what we need to do as responsible pet owners, let's be proactive. Let's not let our dogs roam uh, freely, especially at night uh, when the wildlife is more active. Summit Lost Pet Rescue says they have a couple of things they want people to make sure that they're doing in order to avoid a situation with these mountain lions. One, keep their dogs on a leash. Two, keep their cats inside. And three, just don't leave any pets out overnight, expecting them to come home safe and sound because they just might not. In Silverthorne, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first.